Imagine this, a ship vanishes in broad daylight only to reappear hundreds of miles away and then reappears back to its original location. Seems straight out of a sci-fi movie, right? Well, in the midst of World War II, an extraordinary event unfolded that seemed to defy our understanding of physics. The USS Eldridge, a newly commissioned destroyer, was at the heart of this mystery. With powerful generators and a mission shrouded in secrecy, the ship was rumored to possess technology that could render it invisible to enemy radar and mines. In the bustling Philadelphia Naval Yard, the crew decided to test this technology right there in broad daylight. Then, something unimaginable happened. A green fog enveloped the ship and in the blink of an eye, it was gone. Not just invisible, but vanished. It reappeared hundreds of miles away in Norfolk, Virginia, only to return to Philadelphia moments later. But then, something unimaginable happened. The USS Eldridge may have reappeared, but its crew was left in a horrific state. They were disoriented, some had severe burns, and the most unfortunate ones were fused into the ship's very walls. Unable to free themselves, they were trapped in a molecular prison. The agony was unbearable and it led to their untimely demise. Others lost their sanity, while some vanished without a trace. The nation was shaken by this bizarre event, and many fervently believed in its authenticity, Yet, the official records challenge the credibility of the Philadelphia experiment. According to the ship's logs, the USS Eldridge was in New York at that time, not Philadelphia. But does this nullify the entire story? Not quite. As it turns out, the US Navy was indeed conducting experiments, not on teleportation or invisibility, but on something a bit more grounded. The real goal was to shield US ships from the magnetic mines deployed by the Germans. These mines were triggered by magnetic fields, and to counter this, the Navy tried to alter the ship's magnetic field. They used magnetic coils and electrical cables that emitted a strong pulse, aiming to make their ships undetectable to these deadly underwater traps. This story came to light through Carl M. Allen, who claimed to have witnessed the event, and Morris K. Jessup, an astronomer and author known for his works on UFOs. Their accounts spurred a plethora of conspiracy theories extraterrestrial involvement, government cover-ups, interdimensional travel, every theory more fascinating than the last, yet none could conclusively explain the incident. The Philadelphia experiment remains shrouded in mystery, inviting conjecture, conspiracy theories and endless debates. Despite the passage of time, the enigma persists, the questions remain, the theories multiply, and the Philadelphia experiment continues to captivate the curious, the skeptics, and the believers alike.